Hey everybody, it's Colin here with Only Together, and today we have uh, cards opening for the Hidden Fates uh, Pokemon set. And what we have today is a small collection of some of the items that you can get for Hidden Fates. Uh, in the back we have the Hidden Fate boxes, and I grabbed uh, one of each of these um, art sets. And so we have Raichu, Charizard, and Gyarados. And then in front of them we have the corresponding tins. So again, Raichu, uh, Charizard, and Gyarados. And then I have an assortment of Hidden Fates blister packs here. We have five total, which is a total of 10 booster packs. And we're gonna open them all up, see what they're all about, and see if we can pull uh, something nice and shiny for us today. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, I think start with the tins. I'll open all these up, and then what I'll do is I'll take out the boosters, and we'll put those to the side because we'll open those afterwards. We'll take a look at what comes inside uh, each of the tins, just in case you guys are curious. And then I'll move on to the boxes in the back afterwards. We'll do the exact same thing. We'll open them up, take a look at what's inside, move the booster packs off to the side so that we can... Uh, open those all together at the end. Don't mind my cat if you can hear him. So as mentioned, there's three of these here. So we're going to open up the first one and see what we have inside. So this is the uh, promo art card for Gyarados. Looks pretty nice. I'll just leave it inside of this uh, package for now. We don't need to look at it too closely. Um, but yeah, it's... Uh, Pretty nice card. You get the tin itself, which is really nice, obviously. And then inside you get four hidden face boosters. So as mentioned, I'll move those over to the side. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put Gyarados back inside the tin, since there's not a whole lot else to explore in there. Just wanted to look at the promo card. We'll move on to our next one, which is Charizard. Very nice. We have the packs inside. Uh, this one gets a 3 out of 10, as this one came flying out a little too aggressively. One, two, three, four. And again, we'll put Charizard back inside. And last but not least, one of my personal favorites, that being Raichu. Very cool looking promo card. 10 out of 10 for this packaging, very clean. I also got how it comes with, I like how it comes with one of each of the arts uh, pieces on the front. We'll move this over. And Raichu goes back inside of his box. I'll probably end up just keeping these tins as are, or as is, uh, for my own personal displays. I don't end up using them for, for much else. So I'm gonna move these over to the side, and we can go ahead and open up um, some of these boxes. Again, I grabbed one of each. So let's see what the, uh, the best way to get into one of these is. Probably just slide it down the side. Easy enough. So as we saw earlier, this is the Gyarados promo card. It's gonna be the exact same as the one that we saw in the tin. We're gonna go ahead and get four promo packs and uh, online code. The main difference is obviously the giant 
promo card that you get. And these are pretty cool. It's the back. If you guys have ever opened any of these boxes, it's not going to be much of a surprise to you. We'll go ahead and release Charizard next. And speaking of Charizards, obviously one of the major chase cards uh, in this set is going to be that shiny, uh, shiny Zard. So today that's kind of what we're hoping for. Um, otherwise, there's some really great uh, evolutions that you can get. Um, as well as a Mewtwo, uh, and some other awesome stuff, of course. We're not really hoping or expecting anything uh, today when we open these. Just wanted to take a look at each of these uh, specific products for you. Charizard again. One, two, three, four. Promo. And giant promo Charizard. Last but not least, we have our Raichu. So we'll go ahead and get into this box really quick. Raichu promo number two. One, two, three, four. Three Mewtwo's. So maybe we'll get one in there. Who knows? Promo code. And our giant Raichu card. Fun. So you guys probably noticed in the background as well, I do have a few more um, Hidden Fates boosters that I have. Um, that's actually uh, just a small portion of what I actually had. I opened a bunch already um, off camera, and I'll probably be um, moving these ones on to, to somewhere else, um, whether it be um, through like local sales or online, or I'm not sure. Maybe I'll open them in like a, a group break if you guys like to do that, or like a rip and ship or something fun. Um, but yeah, that's that's kind of what we have going on in the background there. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and, don't mind the noise, rip open the whew, last of these guys. If any of you guys catch the actual promo code number, you're more than welcome to use it. Wow, this one was, it felt like it was glued in there. That was kind of strange. So again, these blisters come with two uh, booster packs in them. Which is usually a little bit easier. If you guys already have uh, like the promo boxes or uh, the tins, but you didn't get what you wanted, then I would say these blister packs are probably your next best bet. It sort of gets a uh, gets rid of sorry the uh, the bulk and the excess, and you just get the the boosters themselves. So I didn't count. I don't really remember exactly how many there were, but we're gonna go through these and uh, see what we can get. I'm not gonna do the I'm not gonna do the card trick for everyone. I'll just do it the first time and then I'm gonna fly through them because we don't need this video to be so long. Um, but this is what a general uh, booster pack will look like. So an energy, jinx, Pokemon Center Lady, <laughs> Metapod, coughing, Cubone, Geodude, Slowpoke, a Clefairy. 
Um, and then the second to last is usually um, like a reverse hollow or something. So this is actually a Kangaskhan reverse hollow. Uh, and this is a rare card, so that's always nice to get. And then for our last card, we got a Vaporeon. So actually not terrible, two rares, uh, one reverse hollow and one regular hollow. So I'll just move our hollows over there. All this base stuff, I will find a home for. There goes the pile, uh, off camera. So again, I'm gonna go through these a little bit quicker um, for you guys so that we can save a little bit of time. And again, what we're looking for is Charizards would be great. Evolutions would be great. But there's a bunch of other good stuff too. Here's a Butterfree Reverse and uh, Giovanni's Exile. Very cool. Actually, that's four rares right off the bat. So no no complaints from, the, from those first two packs. We got a Magnezone as well as the Moltres and Zapdos and Articuno uh, GX Tag Team. Very cool. I think I have one of those already. I'll sleeve everything up after for the sake of the video. We have Stakata. <laughs> Sorry, Stakataka. I'm not sure really what happened to my brain there. Uh, Stakataka, as well as an Eevee. So hopefully the Eevee is a sign of good things to come. But this is also a very cool card. So we got a Jesse and James, as well as a Guzzlord. Very cool. So we have another tag team. Uh, first we have the Shop It, and that's just a regular hollow. And then Moltres and Zapdos and Articuno tag team uh, again. Oops. Boop. I'll show you the different versions. Let me just get my stack back into line there. And I'll try not to bump the camera again. Next pack. We have a Greninja. Oops, what did I miss here? There's our rare. Greninja and then our Snorlax for our rare. If you guys went hunting for like the Charizard or a specific like evolution or something, let me know. Like, let me know how many packs it took to get the one you wanted. Um, and yeah, let me know down below in the comment section if you guys opened anything super awesome or anything you were really hunting for. I'd love to hear it from you guys. Also, this will be one of the first videos actually that I end up posting on this channel. Uh, this is going to be my um, card and collectibles channel. So things like Pokemon, uh, potentially Yu-Gi-Oh, NBA, NFL, baseball, sports cards, stuff like that. So if you guys like that kind of stuff, give it a subscribe. It'd mean a lot to me. Uh, so we have a, a coughing reverse hollow, and then we have another Jesse and James.
Charmander, hollow, very cute. And then Blaine's Last Stand as our rare. If you guys are looking to purchase um, any Hidden Fates packs, because you guys haven't gotten what you want yet, um, or you want any of these in the back, um, leave a comment in the section down below, send me a message, um, or find me on Facebook under Only Together or Colin Ross. I'm in a bunch of Pokemon groups, so it shouldn't be that hard to find me. Uh, we have another Jesse and James, so those are stacking up nicely. And then we have a Buzzwool. Very cool. Charmeleon Reverse, and a Mr. Mime Rare. Uh, I will, of course, keep some of these for my personal collection, um, but if you guys wanted anything specifically that you've seen out of here that you just couldn't get your hands on for some reason, uh, you can let me know as well. And uh, if I don't want it for my PC, then I can um, go ahead and help you guys out with that. So we have a Gabite, as well as the Butterfree. Let me get my piles back into some sort of order. I'm gonna move this over and then I'm gonna start a new one just so they don't get too high. Because we've still got quite a few packs to go. Well, that looks familiar. Uh, Mr. Mime Reverse Hollow, though, and then a regular Butterfree. We have a Wimpod and a Lapras as our rare. We have our uh, Froki upside down, and then our Jesse and James. This is 68 of 68 though, so this will be the last of the um, regular rares before it gets into the secret rares, so that's pretty cool. Hopefully now we can break over that number and start pulling this, start pulling the secret rares. We have a Reverse Holo uh, Koga's Trap, and then an Arbok as our rare. Hmm. I just had a pile of stuff fall over. I'll have to sort that out better next time. Got ourselves a Reverse Hollow Pikachu and Misty's Water Command.
Arbok, this time Reverse Hollow, and a Kangaskhan. And that does it for our first um, pile of packs. We'll move on to these guys now. That's what we're looking for. If we can get one of those, that'd be really nice, obviously. I would definitely take an evolution though as well. But we all know we're hunting the Zards. Voltorb Reverse and Erica's Hospitality. Unfortunately, not hollow. I do have a hollow, a hollow version of it though. Swablu and another Misty's Water Command. This pack gave us a little bit of difficulty, so let's hope that it was just guarding something uh, super awesome inside of it. We'll see if that holds true. Well, Psyduck and a Lapras, I wouldn't necessarily call super awesome, but that's okay. Saw something. There we go. I thought that I saw something. Gable Reverse. And the theme of the day, which is Moltres, Zapdos, and Articudo tag teams. So this one is 69 of 68. So we just broke into the uh, secret rares. Keep them off to the side for now. I actually have one of those also already. So not that I'm like disappointed, but you know, it's nice to it's nice to pull something different. Ekans and a Blaine's last stand again. This pack's um, seal its kind of fraying and a little bit suspicious. It's also like really warped, so we'll see. We'll see what that means. It also ripped really weird. Yeah, that's not cool. All right, well, let's see what we can do. Gibble and an electrode. Kind of felt like repacked or something weird, but I didn't really see where that one came from, whether it was from a blister or from one of the, the tins. If it was from the tin, obviously I don't think it was repacked, but Scyther and a Snorlax. This one too. Kind of weird. But it's like that on both sides, so I don't see why they would reseal it on both sides. Hollow Energy and a Mr. Mime. Beldum and another Lapras. We have a few of those now. Voltorb Reverse and Brock's Training.
Wimpod and Erica's Hospitality. Okay. Misty's Water Command, I think for the third time, and Brock's Grit. Three more. Let's see what we can get. Let's see if we can have some final pack mojo. Another Kangaskhan, as well as another foiled energy. happening here. Giovanni's Exile. Had that one earlier. And Pokemon Center Lady again. So those are both dupes for us in this opening. And final pack. Can we get the last pack mojo? See if we can get something really exciting. Uh, something very short printed or sort of a secret rare or just to finish it off with the Charizard. We did not, but we got ourselves a cute little Mew as well as the reverse Jigglypuff. So these are our three stacks of highlights, which are um, either just rares or reverse hollows um, or things like that. We'll finish off with the three giant promos. And I'll do a quick loop through these. Um, I'll just take out the, the non hollows for myself and you guys can take a look at what we got again if you're so inclined. Again, if you see anything that you're super excited for, uh, really wants, just send me a message and we can make something happen. Always nice to connect with uh, new people. Sorry, my itchy nose. Got a lot of Jesse and James. Tons of Kangaskhan. That's probably pretty. Pretty common, to be honest. Tons, <laughs> tons of tag teams. It's never had so many in, in one single, uh, one single pull. More Jesse and James. Sweet. So to finish it off for you guys, I'll leave you with the theme of today. Tag Team Moltres Zapdos Articuno. This is the secret rare. This is numbered 69 out of 68. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you guys had some fun ripping your own hidden fates as well. Keep an eye out for next video. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and subscribe down below. Please leave a comment as well and hit that uh, like button so that I know that you guys enjoyed the content. And I'll be sure to come back with you guys with more uh, trading card content in the future. So again, thank you guys so much. We'll see you next time.